Hey everyone, in this video I'm going to show you guys how to use Seafoam to end up with better MPG and horsepower. Uh, but basically in the end this helps clean and dissolve any carbon buildup. Uh, what I got here is the spray and a little funnel, some pliers, and here's the main star of the show right here. So this is the Seafoam fluid and right here this is uh, what you'll be using. It's a 100% petroleum product. It won't ruin your seals, it'll clean your injectors, clean your oil. And uh, this is the spray version right here. This is good for your intake manifold. Has a special little nozzle here to make you clean out your intake manifold. So I got some pliers, a little funnel. And yeah, let's go on out and clean the gunk out of our engine and injectors. So this is a, a great little setup to use if you are uh, just having trouble with pinging or passing uh, emissions tests, Seafoam is your answer. This will uh, clean out all the carbon, especially in your catalytic converter. So before you uh, get a new catalytic converter, this is definitely an option to go. These cans are under six, seven bucks at Walmart or Amazon. So before you spend a thousand to two thousand dollars on a catalytic converter, uh, let's blow all that white and blue smoke out of the back end and clean all that stuff out. So with all your equipment and everything ready, I'll show you the three places we can use the sea foam. Uh, one of them, you won't need your car running. The engine, you do need. You don't want it too hot. I mean, you want to blow really hot fumes up when you pour it in. So cold engine, if you want to put it in your crankcase. Uh, cold engine, if you want to put it in your gas tank. The only one that needs to be warmed up is when you put it in your brake booster. Um, vacuum lines. So the first one I'm going to do here is going to put it through the engine oil. This will clean out all my injectors. You usually want one to two ounces per gallon. I have about half a tank of gas which is around 13 gallons so I'll put around 13 ounces in here. Each can's 20 ounces I believe. Um, this is great. I mean you can do it every 10 to 15 thousand miles. Just clean out all the injectors and I recommend a little funnel just because it's pretty hard to to pour in and you need to disengage a little little cover in there. I don't know if it, you can see it. So a little funnel pushes it down and the part that you need your car warmed up is the brake booster. This will clean out your back end especially your catalytic converters. So this is when you see all the white smoke that you see on all the other YouTube videos that where people use sea foam. So your brake boosters is right here on the driver's side right in front of you you see a little brake uh, canister and right there is the brake booster and so after your car is warmed up uh, you after five to ten minutes make sure it's nice operating temperature you want to pull the brake booster in Mercedes it's pretty easy there's no clip or anything and you want to make a funnel this is a vacuum right here so you want to pour very very slowly you don't want your engine to stall you do want to do like about half a can so Make sure you get around two cans total. And the key here is nice and slow. So first two thirds of the half can, really slow. The last third, you want to do it really fast to stall your engine and have it stop and sit there for about 10 minutes. And while minutes. you're doing this, uh, you will have some extra fumes. They will smell nasty. This is all your carbon buildup. And you, your majority of your smoke will be uh, once you drive around the city and do some spirited driving. So that's where a lot of your blue and white smoke, the first time you put your uh, foot down on that pedal, you're going to see so much smoke, it's going to be crazy. So you want to drive around, maybe do a one or two gas tanks worth of this sea foam. And yeah, you should be good for emissions and everything else. You should really feel a difference. Thank you. Have any questions? Links below for Amazon, the cheapest prices.